going to show you how to create a clickable activity choice board and by that I mean you are able to click on the different parts of an activity and it takes students to the activities down the side here. So what I've done is I have created this activity choice board here on the drawing tools. These are all pictures that I have uploaded of the activities I want them to do. These are text boxes here. Uh, and I've just got these little squares down here to be used uh, with the pencil to tick them off when they have done them. Uh, and so what you do to make this work and to make them clickable is you um, drag on the pictures that you would like to use. So I'm just going to show you here. So I'm going to upload a photo that I would like to use in that spot. So I'm just going to find the one that I want to use, which is this one. You then resize it to where you'd like it to go. You're going to click on the three dots and then you're going to click on link. And this is going to take you to either into a website or you can link it to a different page. These ones down here being the pages. So I'm going to link it to page four. I then am going to lock it in place, and which means it's not going to move. And so if I click on this link here, it's then going to take me to page four here, which is the activity I want them to do. Uh, and then you can do the same for each of these activities here. They each are links. This one's linked to page two, this one's linked to page three and page four. Now on the activities as well, I want them to have another link which can take them on to the next one or to take them back to the choice board. So I've made these really quick little text boxes here and I'm going to do the same thing to make it link on to the next activity. I'm going to click on the three dots, I'm going to click link, I'm then going to click on the one I want it to go to which is now page three. I'm going to lock that in place and then I'm just going to check it. Yep, make sure it works. Now this one here, I want this one to take them back to the home page uh, in case they want to go back to check what activities next. Same thing, click on link. Which one do I want them to go to? I want them to go back to number one. And then I'm going to lock it in place. I'm going to check it works. Yes, it does. And so students can click through all the activities. Now, when it comes to the last activity here, there's actually um, a choice board one here, which takes them back. Or there's the last bonus activity, which is actually a reflection activity. And this would be to reflect on the learning of the week. Here there are three smiley faces or three faces to reflect on their learning and how they feel. They could write something here about how do they feel about their learning, whether it's tricky, easy, um, anything that they want to work on more. And then when they're done, same thing, this takes them back to the choice board. So this could be used in any way for your students. Uh, this is a template that I really quickly made just before. Um, you can change it, make them more activities, less activities. Uh, and the link feature is really handy for them to navigate them to exactly where they want to go. Perfect for littles. No need to explain the instructions. They can just click through.